This rain dreaming. These group in certain groups they dance to their hearts.
way back from our ancestors, some uh, disease. This is to do with the land, the song life. Yet today, I'm a grandmother of uh, 12, and yet still I'm learning. This is the patient that to do with the cultural, you know, where the uh, procedures in our life. This is what it means. Well, um, <coughs> welcome to all of you. Um, I'm Danny Powell, I'm the festival director, and we're also live streaming this session. So people in Tennant Creek, Bachelor, Borolula, Nooka, Darwin, Palmerston, and Port Augusta, welcome to you as well, and to come into this little intimate space here. So um, I'll just just also acknowledge that um, we we acknowledge the Aranda people as the traditional owners of this country in Bantua, Alice Springs, where we're holding this festival and they are the, the story holders of this place. And thank you so much for coming to this very special launch today. Um, these Walpuri women have been working on a book about Yaoliu, 
the songbook in particular songs. So we don't have much time left because another session will begin and we can't stop that from happening and we don't want you to miss it. But it doesn't mean you have to race away. Um, if you are going to that session at 10.30 in the gazebo, just know that you will move off. We won't announce that. Okay? And you can be here if you want to be. So I will hand to Georgia or to Barbara. Thank you. Um, to us, there's a book about Yaoya and we are dedicating to those to the Malia who have passed on um, and now we have few old people here. Some are in wheelchairs but we also want to present this to them. To uh, Tujumalia. Tujumalia is called the strong elders who are still here, and they are the ones who are boss for uh, uh, Yawayo. And I would like to acknowledge Aranda people. You are Yumanari Jama, Maninyanya, Kujanalo Karija, Karami, Kujanalo Karami, Nyambona, Wayanga, Aranda Kulamula, Murala. Mani yumo nali jana midira na respect aranda padogo yuro wanogo mani chala mwanogo. We wish to acknowledge that we are standing on aranda land and we would like to show our respect to aranda people from the past and present. You know, this dance was done in two parts. One was about ngapa and water dreaming. Another one was mina mina. So a name of a place, and I'm also a traditional owner for Minamina. I'm part of the lake, and the, these two ladies who dance are um, my. Um, we are uh, one dreaming, one chukurba. Um, yeah. I would like to read some chapters that I've present this at the uh, uh, knowledge center. It's a cultural property. First, we, we would like to remember all the ancestors from the past who have given us their knowledge of Yaoyo and the Chukupa stories and songs that we know today and that we are passing on to a younger generation. We have two parts to ownership of Wolverine, Yaoyu, Kira and Christian knowledge of Chukupa, Yaoyu stories and land. The other part is the Kurongo, the servant, workers or policemen who make sure that the Kiras are doing everything right. We get ownership from our father and his father before. Cousins are horrible for each other. We always remember those who have passed on and at respect for those who are still here. They are passing their knowledge on to the kids in the future. These books are dedicated to these from the past who have made sure that they have taught it the right way so that it can be passed on to the future. It's all their artwork, their songs, dance, going to country and writing down the stories about that country. It's not just country, it's a place with stories and a spirit. The old people have taken us there and show us the right direction where the Jukupa is and all the stories and songs in that land. They carry this knowledge and these stories from their ancestors and about all the dreamings. They tell us where it st started and where it ends. It connects us to the people in the other places. We are all connected. Uh, all people could read the chukurba that is painted on their body and in sad stories of chukurba painted on canvas. Today, uh, young people can read and write. This is why. The reason why we want to put some of this knowledge in books and to record and take video of our song stories and body painting is to keep it safe so children can know it and their children in the future. All old people are passing away. They are the ones who are trying to keep this going for kids in the future. We are losing all our elders with their knowledge. 
We don't know when, we don't want to lose this. Deep, deep knowledge of country and Jukabra songs and stories. All their songs are really deep art language. Yaoyu songs are different from where we go. The songs that we are recorded are different. They are deep, strong, one breath. It's sung in a different way from the language that we speak. Our songs, in, our songs are in a rich art language. We don't understand everything right away. We need the old people to tell us what these songs mean, the rich, special way that they sing it. A feeling goes into our heart and makes us feel special. The Jarawanda book has proved to be a useful tool for our young generation to learn these aspects of their cultural heritage. Projects like this value our deep culture and all the stories and knowledge. We work with researchers in collaborations. They want to learn about our culture and they bring interest and feeling to us. We want to do keep our knowledge and our, uh, for and for rich researchers they keep to write keep help write it down. They are like a machine to help us write it down. This is a really important as we want to record all our sugar band songs from our old people. They won't be here forever to sing, to dance and to tell us how to do it. We want to we want to be able to teach the next generations. These projects bring everyone together. The old people make sure the stories and songs are straight. Younger people listen and get painted up and dance. Thank you. We were going to sh show you part of the DVD, which is in the back of this book which is a recording we made last year of the Yalpurulan story, which you just saw about two age brothers meeting together. Um, unfortunately, we don't have time, so we won't do that. If, um, if, uh, if um, the people that are going to that next session at the gazebo, which is featuring Lizzie Markley, Ellis and Renee McBride talking about memoir, if they could just quietly move out to go to that, then you can show the video, that's yeah. fine. We'll be yeah. in a yeah. 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 Um, so to end, end yourself. Yeah, I'm I'm George Curran, <laughs> working with all these ladies on a book called um Yinuru Wariki, Jujung Ali Klang Yawu. Um it's a big name, but all those words are really important words to acknowledge all of the old old ladies here and all the ancestors from the past. Yeah. And um yeah, well if we probably don't have time to introduce everyone. Um, you've heard from Barbara just there.